we're now going to simplify complex rationals with a different method which the book calls method 2. I'm going to call it the LCD method. And so we're going to start with the problem 1 over 5 plus 1 over x all over x plus 5 over 2. And if you're looking at this, it should look familiar. It's the same example we started with before. But what we're going to do is we're going to look at our small rationals. And we're going to find the LCD of these small rationals. And that's 5, 2, and x. So our LCD is 10x. 5 times 2 times x. We're then going to multiply the top and the bottom by 10x over 1 and 10x over 1. So remember, this is 1, the whole thing is 1, and each piece goes to the top and to the bottom, but it goes to the numerators of each one. So we're going to distribute to get 1 over 5 times 10 over x plus 1 over x, which is 10 over 1, not 10 over x, 10 over 1, all over x plus 5 over 2 times 10 over, that is our x. 1. And so on top, we simplify each one. The 10 and the 5 leaves a 2. The x and the x leaves a 10. And so on top now, we have 2x plus 10 over, on bottom, the 10 and the 2 leaves a 5. 5x times x plus 5. So now all we have to do is factor our numerator, pull out an x plus a 2 leaves an x plus 5. And when we divide out our x plus 5's, we're left with 2 over 5x. So by using method 2, instead of method 1, we made the numerator itself just a single polynomial. We made the denominator a single polynomial. And then we're able to simplify, as we've always done, with rational expressions. Now, to make sure we understand this more, we're going to do one more example. So we have 1 over x plus 1 over x minus 2, all over x over x bar minus 4 plus 1 over x minus 2. And again, we're going to factor this. We're going to find our LCD, which is x times x minus 2 times x plus 2. And we're going to times that to the top and the bottom. Over 1. And there's a shortcut here where all we really need to write is what's left over. So this is x minus 2 times x plus 2 plus x times x plus 2 over x times x plus x times x plus 2. So now we just take this piece and we simplify it and we multiply it out. x squared minus 4 plus x squared plus 2x over x squared plus x squared plus 2x we then combine to get 2x squared plus 2x minus 4 over 2x squared plus 2x. We factor out a GCF of 2 on top, leaving x squared plus x minus 2 over 2x times x plus 1. The 2's then divide out. And our final answer, because there are no factors of, well, no, there are, that factors. x plus 2 x minus 1 over x times x plus 1. And this is our final form since everything has factors.